Hello everybody, today I will be showing you on how to install the or spawn mod or mod and uh with Forge. So Forge is fairly easy to install. So first thing we want to do is very simple here. The first thing we want to do is we want to go into Forge, double click on Forge. Sorry for my mouse, it's kinda like spamming up. But we want to double click on Forge. And then this thing here is going to pop up. And you want to install client. So just hit OK since I already have an install. It will, it will install itself. And then you go into your Minecraft to make sure everything's running good. And It should say starting launcher and stuff and blah blah blah. And after it loads, you want to hit play. And then if it loads correctly, it might crash on the first try. But that's actually kind of. It sometimes does that. Don't just give up. Oh no, it crashed on the first try. Then you like. Just give me hate for it. It's supposed. It, not supposed to, but it does crash. A lot. So after this is loading, we can just go ahead and click this. See, since I already had it installed, I was doing my Let's Play video. I mean, I'm not really gonna. I only do Let's Play videos sometimes. I at number five now. So yeah, pretty good. Pick. Now I've got dinosaurs and stuff. So. I think I might switch the name to Dinosaur Survival instead of Let's Play. So then once it's loaded, as you can see it is loading, it's just, for my, it's just kind of weird. See now it's loaded. And everything I think should be working fine. Sorry for that. Alright, so this is loading now. Wait, wait, wait. See, mine's not responding, so. Mine's just like, you see, it's all good, so mine's fine. See, I already have six mods installed though, that's why I have like a dinosaur mod and stuff. Lots of mods. Then you want to exit out that. And then you want to go into your. See this bottom corner thing right here? See got the window sign? Descent. App. Data. Descent. And then like that. And for Windows 8, you want to go into your folders thing here. To do this, you'd want to go into your folders thing at the bottom here. And then once you're in your folders and stuff, you just want to go up to the top corner of the bar here. You want to type in percent, have data percent, and all that. That right there. And then that's going to come up and all that. So. Yeah, and then you want to go into your dot minecraft jar or dot minecraft, not the jar, just your dot minecraft right there. And then see, we don't want to go into our bin. We do not want to go into bin. So now, as you can see, I already have mods installed. So this also works with Optifine too. Let's see, all right. So then all you have to do next is drag that in there. That's all you have to do. And then if you want Optifine, you can just download the jar of Optifine and don't install it and then just drag that in there. And then you can just exit out of there, go down here, run Minecraft, open it up. And we'll see what it does. Well, let's see, just give me a second. Let it load, please. Sorry for some background noise and stuff. Alright, so now, see, so you don't have to go into any versions or anything, it's already installed, but it needs Forge to run it, so you want to get that Forge, and I'm going to leave the links for these in the description, 
and trust me, I won't forget this time, so. Because I usually do forget to post links for stuff. Alright, so. Let's wait for it to load. This shouldn't be as long as the dinosaur one. As you can see, it's, it hasn't been as long so far. See, well, the dinosaur one is lots of mobs. Lots of mobs gives you, like, time machine stuff, and that's the same way. You install lots of mobs the same way as you do spawn. Uh, or mob. Now, this just doesn't spawn ore. It also gives you uh, more creatures to spawn, so. Actually, a little bit more creatures than uh, lots of mobs. This gives you plenty of creatures and brand new ores. So see, you want to go into mods here, and ore spawn mod is right there. No mod inspiration. Uh, it's a single player. So I just create a new world. Come on, there we go. Just name it anything you want. So I'm just gonna call it new. Let's create a create world. And then uh, it should be opening now. So once it opens, I can show you all the stuff that we have. It, all you really have to do is just go watch my spawn or mod review. So wait, wait, wait. It's loading, it's loading, it's loading. Wait, 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 wait. And there we go, and we have Optifine installed too. Damn, I just saw an actual girl down there. Oh, that's my mermaids or something. Alright, so then, see, all you have to do is go into your buckets. And then, oh, look, there's new mobs. Mosquito, moth, butterfly, plenty of other stuff. T shirt, ghost pumpkin scally, all that stuff. All that wonderful, wonderful stuff. Or spawn, yay. Alright, so thank you all for watching this video, and I hope you showed you how to install these mods. So thank you all for watching. And I'm just gonna go chill with this babe. Hey babe. We can have we can have beach sex. Get over here, big girl. Alright, alright, yeah, that's that's it for today. And thank you all for watching this video. Please leave a like, subscribe if this showed you how to install mods. It should work. If it doesn't, don't go all hate on me if you like mess up your Minecraft, because it's not my fault. Like, if you, this doesn't work for you, you did it wrong. And then, so thank you all for watching, guys. Please like and subscribe, and peace out.